Welcome back to Nestology TV. We live in a world filled with jargon and buzzwords, and the financial services industry is no different. In our industry, the biggest buzzword I hear today is the term fiduciary. For a lot of firms, it's a part-time thing. Let me explain why. A couple of years ago, I started to see the title fiduciary advisor come up that didn't exist before. There's a lot of managed accounts out there today, and if you have a managed account with the firm, the advisor, per law, is either licensed with the SEC or a state-governed agency and has to act in a fiduciary capacity, meaning they have to put your interests first. So by definition, every advisor in the United States that offers a managed account, an advisory account, is in term a fiduciary advisor. I got licensed with my 65 in 2001, so I've been a fiduciary advisor for the past 18 years. There is no certification to use this title and it's simply a marketing buzzword. If a fiduciary advisor were to not enter into an advisor relationship and for instance, offer you a highly commissionable annuity product through a separate entity, well then by definition, they are no longer a fiduciary advisor. There's a lot of firms out there that offer you these free steak dinners that operate with these separate insurance companies. So they're trying to make themselves out be this fiduciary when in fact they don't act in that you know, at all times. I, on the other hand, am a certified financial planner and I have to act as a fiduciary at all times. It's not a part-time option. And I think if you're looking for a fiduciary, you're looking for somebody that acts like this in a full-time basis. Don't be fooled by the bait and switch. Make sure you understand the motivation of your advisor. If you have questions, we're always here to help. We'll see you next time.